see this cable? Good. Get under it. What? You aren't hiding. Get under there and stay. Under the table? Just do as I say. I have a plan, but for it to succeed, you must be hidden. So are we agreed? You wanted to know, I'm ready to divulge it. This plan of yours, I'll indulge it. But then I'll lay this thing to rest. Oh, that'll happen. Because he'll fail the test. You see, I'm going to have a conversation I never have, just as an illustration of how this hypocrite behaved with me. So don't be scandalized. I must be free to flirt. Clearly that's what it's going to take to prove to you your holy man's a fake. I'm going to lead him on, to lift his mask, seem to agree to everything he'll ask, pretend to respond to his advances. It's for you. I'm taking all these chances. I'll stop as soon as you have seen enough. I hope that comes before he calls my bluff. His plans for me must be circumvented. His passions strong enough to be demented. So the moment you are convinced, you let me know. I've shown to you the fraud I said I'd show. You're in control. I know I'll be all right. And here he comes. <laughs> I'm told you want to have a word with me. Yes, I'm not here to speak. Close that door, have a look around. We certainly do not want to be found the way we were just as Demi appeared. I was terrified for you, and as I feared, he was irate. I was so upset, I never had the thought to deny it all, which might have helped a lot. <laughs> but, as it turns out, we've nothing to fear. My husband's not upset, it would appear. <laughs> Things are good to heaven, I defer, because they're even better than they were. My husband's good opinion of you is intact. I'm quite amazed, in fact. To clear the air and quiet every tongue, and to kill any gossip that's begun. He won. <laughs> that is why, with no fear of a critical stare, I can be here with you, or anywhere. Most important, I am completely free to show my ardor for you, finally. Ardor? Well, that's a sudden change of tone from the last time we found ourselves alone. If thinking I was turning you away has made you angry, all I can say is that you do not know a woman's heart. How <laughs> <laughs> protecting our virtue keeps us apart and makes us seem aloof or even cold. <laughs> the cooler outside, inside the more bold. <laughs> Ecstasy. <laughs> 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 
She <laughs> wants to spend this time consistently. I've been opening my heart consistently, but for you, it's not enough, this sharing. Yet for a woman, it is very daring. So why can't you be happy with the taste instead of the whole meal consumed in hate? We dare not hope all those of us who don't deserve a thing. And so it is, I won't be satisfied with words. I'll always doubt. Assume my fortune's taken the wrong route on its way to me. <laughs> and that is why I don't believe in anything till I've touched or taken. <laughs> I swear that is the most abominable man. How can I bear this? I don't think I can. 
I'm stupefied. What? Out so soon? <laughs> Straight from hell. How? Oh, you've turned against this man you know so well. Good Lord. Be sure the evidence is strong before you are convinced. You might be wrong. 